Hey, this is Ryan Gordon, and I wanted to talk about SDL 1.2. So 1.2 is unmaintained, so we want to get rid of that, but there's still legacy things using it, such as my favorite SDL test application, the Bouncing Smileys. Um, what we've done is we've written a little wrapper that 1.2 programs talk to, but behind the scenes they're actually using SDL 2, such as that Bouncing Smiley thing, which lets us do things such as, on Mac OS, put those Bouncing Smileys into a full screen space so that you no longer have your whole desktop taken over. You can slide between them. Um, also, this is a software rendered thing, but now it's using metal on the GPU to draw these things and scale them to the right size so it'll work at any monitor resolution you need it to. That's a good deal. Um, now this you've seen before, this is our standard OpenGL test application. Just a spinning cube, nothing fancy. Uh, it's oh, the 1.2 API, but it's talking to two, SDL2 behind the scenes. But I wanted to show you what that same thing looks like on modern Mac OS using the real 1.2. Oh. oh, where did it go? Let me see. Oh, there it is. I see it. Okay. Oh. Oh, it doesn't... Did I miss it? Oh. Mm. No, it doesn't come to the front. That's weird. Maybe, uh... It's not on my desktop. Hmm. Oh, it's not on my taskbar either. All right, so as you can see, this is already an improvement over what you currently have with SDL 1.2. Now I'm going to switch desktops. I don't have a screen recorder on this other one, so it's going to go to a grainy phone video, and I apologize for that. But let's take a look at this. Okay, so this is KDE. There we are. I'm going to launch a terminal real quick. Now I want to show you a game that I love a lot that is now 15 years old. This is Unreal Tournament 2004 running on Linux. Um, if anyone's ever played this before, you know what this looks like. It goes in a window. We're gonna, I'm about to put it full screen. There you go. Now, being 15 years old, this uses SDL 1.2, but this is with the compatibility layer. You can see that it works just fine. It runs at a good speed. Uh, OpenGL obviously still works. Full screen still works. Input still works. Um, and what we have is this is the game running. Now, through the compatibility layer, since we can throw out all of SDL 1.2, that lets us delete 170,000 some lines of code, because uh, SDL 2 is going to do all that heavy lifting for us. And now the wrapper is only about four to 5,000 lines of code, so this will be a massive change. But this is the thing I wanted to show you about Unreal Tournament. Now, when Unreal Tournament was made, there was no such thing as Wayland. Oh, there's that NVIDIA logo again. Boy, I never get tired of seeing that. I'm going to kick that out. There we go. But this window right here, as you can see, is running under Wayland. This is now a native Wayland app from 2004 uh, because the compatibility layer is handling that for it and the app doesn't know any better. In fact, this is the original binary. Anyway, that's what I wanted to show you. I hope you like it. We're going to keep working on this. You'll see more soon. Thank you.